Hi there. You know me, right? I'm Tom Felton and I play Draco Malfoy in Harry Potter and the Half-Blood Prince. But do you really know me? Or Dan, or Emma, or Rupert, in fact? I bet you don't. So I thought it would be fun to jot down a few questions and have my fellow cast members answer them so we can all get to know each other a little better. The key to this is they have to answer right away the first thing that comes to mind. Um, um... Oh, oh my goodness. Like, I would say, what is your favourite word? If it were me, I would say atrocious. It's so expressive, don't you think? Atrocious. Pretty cool word, actually. Shall we see what the gang said? Definitely. Okay, here we go. What is your favourite word? Quidditch. Sponge. Boston. Awesome. Verdurous. Bomb. Your crevice. Glockenspiel. Splendid. Now, if you could eat just one food, what would it be? I like ice cream. Chuck. Indian. Ice cream. Pepperoni pizza. Fish and chips. Chinese. Mediterranean. Ice cream. Pizza. Nutella. Basically on anything. Fish. Fish! Dan, really? It does taste nice. As for me, uh, chalk another one up for ice cream. I'm a chocolate guy. Do you prefer chocolate or strawberry? Chocolate. Chocolate. Strawberry. Both together. Chocolate. Chocolate. Strawberry. Strawberry. Chocolate. Chocolate. Strawberries. Chocolate. Not stupid. I didn't know ice cream preference could be linked to intelligence. My goodness. You defeat one dark wizard, you think you know everything. Let's move away from food for a moment. I uh, always find it interesting which celebrities turn other celebrities' head. So, Hogwarts celebs, which famous person would you most like to spend the day with? Remember, the first person who comes to mind. Queen. Muhammad Ali. Alex Zane. <laughs> uh, Queen Tarantino. But my brother. Oh, how nice, James. Your brother. And I'm sure Oliver would return the favour and say, James. David Beckham. What? David Beckham. I heard you the first time, you ungrateful weasel. How about you, Devon? Angelina Jolie. Ooh, Devon. Angelina Jolie. We'll see if we can work that one out for you, mate. <laughs> <laughs> now, let's travel back in time. Which historical figure would you most like to spend the day with? Lord Byron. William Shakespeare. John Keats. Shakespeare, yeah, that'd be cool. Oh, they're such poets at heart. Anyone else? Muhammad Ali. Robin Hood. Jesus. Martin Luther King. Nelson Mandela. Winston Churchill. Eamon de Valera. Eamon de Valera. Born 1882, New York City. Grew up in Ireland, where he eventually became President of the Republic. Contributed to the writing of Ireland's constitution. And whose New York Times obituary headline read, he dominated Irish life as a fighter, leader, hero and statesman. Goodness, I felt like Hermione. Let's talk about your greatest musical fantasy. If you had your pick of any music act, with whom would you like to talk? Kings of Leon. Led Zeppelin. Brian Jones, Town Massacre. The Pixies. Uh, Iron Maiden. Kings of Leon. Kings of Leon. Uh, Kaiser Chiefs. Oasis. Elton John. The Beatles. Rage Against the Machine. Now, back to reality. Who is the most famous person you've ever met? Robin Williams once. Robert Downey Jr. Annie Lennox. Tom Felton. Ha <laughs> ha Daniel Logan. Kevin Sinfield, Lee Dryden's captain. Princess Diana. Ivana Lynch. Johnny Depp, and that was pretty amazing. Let's dig deeper, shall we? What would you most like to change about the world? All the fighting that's going on. War. Crime. Poverty. Inequality. No war. Poverty. Probably my timekeeping. Happiness. Everyone to be ginger would be good. A ginger world, that would be cool. I should point out to those of you watching outside the UK that this is ginger hair. Was that last question too deep? OK, then. Let's talk about sports, shall we? Which sport would you most like to master? Cricket. Golf. Football. Boxing. Table tennis. Darts. Uh, shoulder jumping. Karate. Martial arts. Football. Golf. Rock climbing. Some kind of martial art that meant I could kick everyone's ass. <laughs> Yes, well, I guess we know not to mess with them now, don't we? I noticed no one mentioned two of my favourite sports, rugby and Quidditch, of course. I wonder which they prefer. Rugby, Quidditch, rugby, Quidditch. I'm going to have to go with Quidditch. 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 Rugby. 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 Rugby league. Quidditch. Quidditch. Quidditch, definitely. Quidditch is obviously big on our set. Tell me, do you travel much? Where would you most like to visit? New Zealand. New York. New Zealand. Australia. Japan. Hawaii. India. Russia. South America. Australia. South Africa. Uh, outer space. Now, if your travel plans went terribly wrong and you became stranded on a desert island and could only have one book with you, which book would it be? Great Gatsby. The Old Man of the Sea. Harry Potter. Robinson Crusoe. The Journey of a Peaceful Warrior. The Goblet of Fire. The Northern Lights. Harry Potter. Julie Cooper or the Bible. How to Build a Raft. How to Build a Raft. Quite brilliant. All right, we're coming up to the big finale. You ready for the lightning round? 
Here we go. What is your favourite sound? The sound of the crowd when a goal goes in. Chalk on a blackboard. Music. I don't know. The sound of cooking. A horse neigh. Hush. Crash. Rap. Heavy rain on a window when you're like inside and warm and it's really kind of loud and yeah, that one. <laughs> what makes you laugh? Daro Brian, the stand-up comic. Slapstick. Jokes. People falling over. My friends. Everything. <laughs> Anything really. Roy Atkinson. Ice Age. <laughs> One and two. <laughs> and finally, if you couldn't be an actor, what would you like to be? I'd like to be a cartoonist. Professional sportsman. Set designer. Directing. I'd like to be a singer. Journalist. A lawyer. Skiing. Nunnery. Being a nun. Director. Guitar player. Professional darts player. This has been great fun, but sadly this is coming to an end. As I pose this final question, what are you most grateful for? Lots of things. I've managed to be alive. My mum. Um, for everything. My family. Uh, my parents. My mum. My health. I'm quite grateful for this. For my part in this film. This whole acting thing with Harry Potter. OK, you know the questions. Here are a few of my answers. The Beatles, the weather in England, golf, Quidditch, Fiji, a coin in water, Harry Potter, life, a musician. And once again, life, that's all for now. Thanks for joining us, and we'll see you at Hogwarts. Is that it? That's it. Oh, that's pretty good.